Ladies and gentlemen, it is now my pleasure to introduce to you South Australian leading rainsman, Ryan Rorick. Ryan, when I did my homework today, you'd had 124 winners chalked up and I've just about had to change it by race by race. You've driven a treble already. Yeah, no, it's been a good start of the day. And you've had a, a, I mean, a, a really good season. First to 100, first time you beat uh, David Harding to 100 this year. Yeah, no, it's been an exceptional year. Um, just lucky enough to have some nice horses and been um, able to get on some, some good ones that aren't of mine just uh, for people I drive for as well. Yeah, well, of course, um, you know, you're going to play down your own ability, of course, but that comes into it. Um, your ability to get them away is fantastic. Um, yeah, I mean, that's up other people's to form their opinion. But, um, yeah, we just, you know, it's all about the horse quality and stock, in my opinion, what you drive. You know, you can only do so much with what you're allowed to sit behind, so the horsepower certainly comes into play. Ryan, how long have you been in the industry? Yeah, no, I grew up in the industry through the family. Um, Dad obviously trains and, uh, yeah, been in it all my life. Ryan, you're now uh, branching into the training area. Was that just a, a progressive step for you? Yeah, no, we've um, sort of, you know, started out probably four or five months ago. <clears throat> um, I was only driving at the time and, yeah, started off with about probably eight horses, but, yeah, it's soon growing um, into not a bad number. Um, yeah, got a very, very good um, support of owners behind me and, you know, some good lads that help work for me as well. So, um, yeah, it all helps. You've got some youngsters. Flag bearer, is that the flag bearer? Yeah, yeah, she is. Unfortunately, um, she's gone amiss, which is a, a big blow to the team. And, um, yeah, another one of um, Mr Batty's owners as well, Starcross, she's gone amiss. So, yeah, that was a big blow, but hopefully the uh, two-year-olds can um, take their place. So you're, you're finding you okay with the mixture of the driving and uh, training? It's just a, it's a harness racing thing, really, isn't it? Yeah, for sure. I mean, you, you know, lucky enough that, that the lads who, who, who helped me and worked for me, um, you know, they're big enough and, and ugly enough to uh, take over and harness them up for me at the races and stuff and my job to uh, come to the races is just to, just to drive and during the week it's to prepare the horses and get them ready. Mate, um, you're definitely not the first person that, uh, uh, that I've spoken to that uh, uh, praises the, um, uh, the quality and um, the ability of the team. Yeah, for sure. I mean, you, just, you, know, you can't do it on your own and I'm a massive believer of working horses together at home and um, you've, got to, you've got to have good lads that can drive and good lads of work ethic as well and you know if you don't have owners don't have horses so I'm lucky at this stage that we've got a good uh, mix of everybody. Ryan thanks for your time and may the success continue. Thanks. Ladies and gentlemen leading rangeman Ryan Rohorik.